What's happening, board gamers? Welcome to the After Action Report for X Fact or X Force versus Hellfire Club. And oh my goodness, what a wild game that was! It was uh, brutal. I, I'm gonna say the I came into this game without a solid plan. It hurt me a lot early on. Yep. I was able to kind of claw my way back there. I was getting so so hopeful there. Yep. Uh, and then friggin' bullseye. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and say Psylocke and Cable are a good team together. I like them. I like him. I like given that extra little bit of reroll is is really kind of nice. Uh, Silo just friggin' dummy Rhino there. Yeah, that felt yeah. good. Yeah, you you were disappointed you didn't get the incinerate on him, and I was like, oh no, that's fine. That that worked. Yeah, no, that that, that was good. Uh, I kind of wish I had maybe done my uh, uh, my regular attack first. Yeah, just to gain a little bit of extra power. Sure. Uh, but eh, it is what it is. Like getting a little bit of extra power, then going hard and do probably was the better call there. Uh, but I like the stun. I didn't think Bullseye was going to be able to do that much damage to me, and then he just friggin' spiked with that pink cushion. Yes, yeah, uh, which was just yeah frustrating. But it is what it is. I mean, you you rolled hot in that last roll there, and that was my best attack roll all game. It was yeah, great. your your attack dice were relatively cool for a lot of the game. Then just Bullseye rolls in, and uh, just I think I think I had a good splash, and I had Bullseye, and I think that was that yeah. was about it. Um, yeah. So okay, so let's talk Hellfire Club. Yeah, because I I think. I was actually really impressed with Hellfire Club this uh, this game. Yeah, so it feels like something you can have a lot of control over. You're you're planning out a lot of your moves, so like, I'm like, yeah, I think Blob can take a damage. Yeah, I think so and so can take a little bit of damage. And in this because, game, you absolutely could. And and like, I'll power up uh, Emma, and like, I think there's going to be games where Emma's going to be a centerpiece where she's going to need power, and you're going to be like, yeah, I'm going to pick up some objectives, but this guy's going to pick up this objective and sit on this one. And these four guys are just going to be hanging out in here. So yeah, and it, it's really kind of interesting because I wasn't quite sure how Hellfire Club was going to kind of play into uh, play into the gameplay. Yeah, right in general, so, right? Because I was thinking like, oh, well, you know, you're powering up Emma, but I think that was a problem. I kept thinking about it, it's like, well, how does it benefit her? Yeah, and I wasn't thinking about how it benefits the rest of your team. So and and I definitely going into this was thinking about that I could power up either Emma or my team, but more bodies meant more more fights. So. Like, there was a time when I have a uh, rocket and a Koye instead of Rhino, and I was like, okay, I'm seven wide with Hellfire Club. This this seems exciting. I just didn't feel like I had enough staying power to hold the points that I wanted to. Yeah, um, I, and you know what? I, I, I got to say, like, not taking out Bullseye with Cable in that first that first yeah. attempt. It's yes. like, oh, yeah. yeah, and, yeah. And, he, and he runs away, away yeah. throws a, a, a yeah. knife at him, and, like, I'm out. And the funny thing is, like, there was there was a handful of situations in this game where I feel like, like, if I just be able to press it a little bit further, right? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, like, I, I don't, you know what? I didn't get diced. It averaged down in the end for me. I think uh, so. Like, the first couple of rounds were just really demoralizing. Well, and, uh, you, you had fine attack rolls. I just had out of the box defense rolls. Okay, like, your defense rolls are crazy. Like, oh, you got you got three uh, out of four. Your your things are hits. Oh, that's great. I have three defense. But round three really kind of came around for me yes. a little bit on that one. So uh, which I'm very thankful. Very exciting time. There is a Wolverine that's from X Force that did something. Oh my goodness! Did Wolverine do things? Like he came in, he dummied friggin' Dark Star, and then went yep. into. I wasn't expecting to get Emma. With yeah. That. Yep. Like, I was looking at your defense dice. I'm like, ah, you know, seven dice. I get the throw. Maybe I can deal. And he did some good job uh, fighting Blob, too. So, like, he didn't just, like, go down like a chump. Now, you didn't have to use exceptional healing, which kind of sucks. Yeah, well, that was the funny thing about this game. You did not really go into me all that hard with any attacks, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah. And so I never... The only opportunity that was really good for me to use it was when you were going into Deadpool, but it was like, it doesn't matter because you just go into him anyway. Yeah. Maybe I should have made you use the power. Yep. Yeah, that's um, fair. Because Rhino only has two uh, two power left at the moment, doesn't he? Uh, yeah, yeah. So if I had made him use the power, that might have been one less stampede, one less, uh, no, this is a rock. Yeah. Uh, you know, I should have made you spend the power. Yeah, as it turns out. Ah, oh, nuts. Oh, that's unfortunate. I, sh I should have made you do it just to spend the power on that one. Well, and the worst thing about that is, is like, you, you couldn't have known at that time, right? No, so, but... I, but I totally I totally had the dream of, this is a robbery, steal the thing from Cable at the end, as the last activation of the turn, have the three uh, legacy viruses, and, and he's went, and just like way. Black Widow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you were just one one power yeah. shy from that one. Well, and I also... I also needed to survive the round, which Psylocke was going to definitely I'm, make sure. I'm actually surprised that uh, you did your attack into Psylocke, not into Cable. 
to be honest. I thought you were going to yeah. punch him. Punch I, I, I was thinking I had, this is a robbery and enough power to pick up the legacy cures. So I thought everything well, I needed to do that's was That's why that. I thought you were yeah. going to go into him, right? Because then, then you just, this is a robbery. You deal your last point of damage you need with the throw. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Um, so yeah, that, that, that's what I thought was going to happen. Uh, I got to say, I still love Psylocke's card. Yeah, I think Psylocke's card is good. I think uh, like just working with the other stuff. Now, I had two turns where I could have done Mind Transfer. That's Emma's uh, special card where I get to move an activated token from one character to another. And You rarely had power to do that, though. I, I actually had it two times, and both times I decided against it because I could have moved Wolverine's activated token to Cable, I believe it was. And instead, I decided I didn't want to activate her. I was going to move on to something else. So it was a, it was a cool kind of thing. I think it's going to matter more in a where you're building Emma up as yeah. opposed to anything else. I, but I, yeah, I got to admit, I at no point was I really playing around mine, uh, mine transfer. I, well, and I think that's game. that's kind of the sneaky part about mine transfer. I think it will have big effects, but you won't notice it till the end. So uh, I will say, I was hoping Punisher was going to do a little bit more for me. And on one hand, he did get some work in, but he never... I don't know. I feel like if I replaced him and Deadpool with, like, Domino and someone else... Domino and Winter Soldier? Domino, yeah. Domino yeah. and Winter Soldier. I think Domino and Winter Soldier, and this would have been a very different game, I think. I agree. Because um, at one point, this list also had uh, Hoth, Fury yep. Senior. Yep. And I think even he would have made a big difference in how this game played. I agree. Um, so, yeah, I mean, I... I don't want to say I handicapped myself on this one, but I wanted to try Punisher and I wanted to try Deadpool and X Force. Yep. Um, Deadpool really just don't put Deadpool up against Rhino. <laughs> As it turns out, not a good matchup. <laughs> As it turns out, uh, now granted, you know, rolling two skulls and re-rolling into a third skull for defense doesn't help the situation at all. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, that was that was just kind of rough getting dummied that way. Um, but you know, it, again, it is kind of what it is. Uh, yeah, I, I had hopes for Deadpool. I, I thought he was going to do a little bit more for me. I wanted to get chimichangas off. Yep. Didn't matter because you just went all in on him. A apparently. Like, it was it was not the intention. It was not like, oh, Rhino is definitely going to run up this side and you have no chance. It was totally like, well, Rhino is now stranded on this side, so he is going to fight the guy who's here. And Rhino did what he does, right? Yeah. Like, I still think Rhino was a solid card. I still don't think he's amazing, but I think he's no. a definitely a solid card. I really like Psylocke as a counter into him. I uh, guess, hundred percent. I'm super glad I, I moved Psylocke over here. I wish, I wish some of her earlier attacks were a little bit better. Yeah, um, yeah, definitely. But I mean, that's just dice being dice, right? Yep. Um, so you're Blob, man. Yes. Blob did work this game. <laughs> now that that thunderous splash is a lot meaner than I thought it was initially. So. Oh, it's it's great. It is fantastic. Um, I mean, if you if you hadn't patched Blob up. At that yeah, time, yeah, like I, he was he was a big target for me because he displaces me a lot. It really so does. And I wanted to deal with him, and I just I couldn't I couldn't peg him off in the first uh, the first round there. Well, and I, I really liked the uh, the control that my team had. I had lots of throws. I had lots of things to throw at people. Yes. Um. And yeah, yeah, and I I, I had even more with uh, Emma if I ever did anything with her. Yeah, like, I, I mean, her leadership popped off really nicely, but I think yes. Emma as a character herself, you didn't really get a whole... Well, okay, no, that that's not true. You displaced both Punisher and Cable. I did. A couple times. I, did. I think you got Wolverine in there as well yeah. at some point. The, the basic attacks. Yeah, because we were talking about it. If uh, if that had been Logan, he would have just gone ballistic and cut up all his friends. So Yeah, so you, you actually displaced me quite a few times, and I think that's not to be scoffed at. Yeah, I f definitely felt like... Uh, Cable had to pay two power every turn to be involved in a in, in yeah. the game, and uh, and I think that's actually why Punisher did so poorly this game because his hip fire is only range three, and that, every time I was getting Punisher into position, you're just yeah. like, no, 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 take a walk back, back to your corner, back to your corner. Uh, no, I, th I think you're absolutely right. I think that was a that was definitely a big impact there. I might my dream was that I was doing the same thing to Wolverine and keeping him out, but as it turns out, he is the best at what he does. Yeah, I'm really happy Wolverine actually did stuff this game. Uh, I didn't quite do exactly what I had planned, but you know him wandering over here and just cutting a bloody swath through was yep. was absolutely great. I'm I'm very happy with what happened there. Uh, I think Cable overall performed quite well yes. in this game. That's I I I don't find that Cable does poorly often. He kind of gets mismatched sometimes, and that's that's a bad time for him. But yeah, 
Yep. Uh, I wish Deadpool had held on for at least one more action. I do too. I think that's what it, I think that's what this flank kind of comes down to. If he held on for one more action, I think it would have been a very different game. I agree. Uh, but unfortunately, like you did just enough damage that even an exceptional healing wasn't going to save his bacon. Yeah. And yeah. Uh, that was just unfortunate. My damage stacked up very well. Yeah. Yeah. You you hit just the right numbers there. Uh, but yeah, true. Well played, man. That was a fun game. I enjoyed it quite a bit, and yeah. uh, looking forward to uh, to seeing these uh, these characters on the table a bit more. Uh, for everyone watching, thank you so much. Uh, leave your comments below. Let us know which like, didn't like, all that sort of great stuff. And if you're looking to support the channel, patreon.com slash Studios. It is a big help. Thank you so much for all of my existing patrons. Uh, you guys are, are making making the dream work and uh, giving me the ability to make upgrades and improvements to all this. Uh, but anyway, yeah, we will see you next time. Happy Wargaming.